Everybody, guess what? Starbomb vinyl box set. Oh my God. March 4th, you can get it at starbomb.com. Yes. Also, everyone who buys a vinyl gets this pin set. Whoa. This pin. Oh my goodness. This pin set. Holy moly. And this beanie, did you see that? Put it on your there head, Daniel. No. The third album's never been on vinyl. First two albums are in here and remixed, remastered. Wow. Okay, actually, we're probably selling that. Yeah, one. starbomb.com. Last time on Game Grumps. Then I should get going too. There are other places I want to investigate. Other people I want to murder. <laughs> <laughs> Visit. <laughs> Where do you intend to go next, Shiaki? Probably the hospital for sure. There's other sick people there that I could murder. Okay. <laughs> she just breaks into song <laughs> to, to cover it. Murder mm -hmm. uh, uh, in the 12 days of <laughs> Miss Five Golden Things. Four Cornish hens, three French dogs, two turtles, and a parsnip <laughs> in a large tree. <laughs> two turtles. <laughs> I'd want to know in advance what I'd have to do to end up like that. Okay. This is what I would look like with a tinier head. <laughs> is it? Should I go with it? Yeah. It's like I'm piloting a mech suit of myself. <laughs> hey, I'm Grump. I'm not so Grump. And we're the Game Grumps. Hey, oh, we're back. Oh my God. Hey, I. Hey, e. Hey, ya. Hey, ya. Boop, 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 boop. Hey, ya. <laughs> all right, all right, all right, all right. All right. <laughs> How Sorry. many times does he say all right? Many it's like times. A, it's like a long, it's like 25. Enough times that I had to stop because I was like, people are going to get annoyed. Oh, there's a Monokuma hidden in the ceiling. Oh, shit. Look have at you, him up there. Have you ever seen, um, Mom Spaghetti? Mom Spaghetti was performed at the Super Bowl last night. No, 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 but Mom Spaghetti. That's whatever it's called. The, who, Eight who, mile, who, who, make who, who, make the boo, make the boo, did the boo, everybody, every day, but car, and I'm gonna don't stop the pop, the sound of the pop. You know, that's how it goes. Eminem? <laughs> but, Is that the name you're trying to think of? Yes. But the, the, the mom spaghetti, some genius, like seven years ago. Recut that entire song. Oh, yes. Where like mom spaghetti is in like every line. Yes, it's wonderful. And it sounds so good. Yeah. Mom spaghetti, it's ready. <laughs> 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 All right. We're back. Yeah, we're back. Chiaki's over here talking about curtains or whatever. Mm -hmm. She's getting frustrated and trying to turn on the lights or whatever. Yeah, troll fail. <laughs> it's a really big window. The room looks more spacious thanks to that. The background oh. looks painted. Well, yeah, the whole background looks all of every background looks painted. Yeah, but I mean like painted like in the world painted. You know what I mean? Oh, like it's a matte painting yes. in the actual world. Yes, yes. Oh, okay. It's a projector. Well, it's not strange for it to be in a conference room after all. This probably isn't a clue. I should look somewhere else. Well then. <laughs> he has all this internal dialogue and then he just says that out loud and Shiaki's like, "You came." <laughs> It's a folding desk. They probably arrange these inside the conference room during meetings. There's nothing that catches my eye! Okay. <laughs> Fuck this place! <laughs> <laughs> so this is a light blocking curtain. That's why it was so pitch black. Guess I'm leaving now. Did you want to check the projector? I did. Oh, you did. It oh, literally just did. That's sad. Are you, like, dying? I thought you checked the whiteboard behind the projector. <laughs> no, it was, it was like, there's a projector here. It wouldn't make sense if there's a conference room. Right you are. That's what he said. This isn't a room for patients. It looks more like an on-call room for hospital staff. But all this clustered medical equipment makes it look like a storage room. If this is the only on-call room, working at a hospital must be tough work. So if a room like this exists, that means there used to be people here, right? What? Shut up! If any room exists, <laughs> there used to be people. <laughs> this is the no people room. Seriously, what the heck is going on? What the heck is going on with this <laughs> island? <laughs> I can't believe that's like a thing. Uh, there's a bed. Next thing. <laughs> it resembles the ones in the patient's room, but these are probably for breaks. Now, what, really? No, they're for people. <laughs> Now it's not the time to rest. I should go back to investigating. Investigating. Medical equipment and nursing tools. There's a lot of other medical stuff here too. 
This looks like it's used to store equipment. <laughs> this room looks used to store equipment. <laughs> There's nothing particular that catches my. Uh, yes. That was really awesome. Yo, yeah. It was that was my favorite part of the whole game. <laughs> When we looked at bed and thing that wasn't interesting, even to the main character. I don't think I like this place at all. Sucks. Down, 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 down. What the hell is- oh, well, whatever. Yeah, I don't care. Let's not talk about it with any other character ever. What in the name of- over it. Can I go in here? Nope. Are they ever gonna actually wheel him in? No. It's just meant to be an adorable thing. It's ridiculous. It really is strange. It's so out of nowhere. And not uh, like anything else in the game. There are parts of the- Danganronpa is very good at, like, being goofy, but there are, like, weird little things that are just unsettling and you can't put your finger on why exactly. Mm -hmm. I guess I'll check out the movie theater. Yeah. There's nothing else to check out. I gotta- I gotta watch the movie or whatever. Oh, no. <laughs> hello there. Why, hello there, Hajime! I knew you'd come here! Uh, I'm already primed and lubricated for this conversation. <laughs> uh, that means you noticed it too, right? The case this time is an imitation case in which the killer used that movie as their theme. It's a plant-based murder. <laughs> I wouldn't know. I haven't watched that movie yet. I prefer soy murder myself. <laughs> I feel like it's more cruelty-free. <laughs> I see. <laughs> Cruelty-free murder. <laughs> I see. Then you really should watch this movie first. Hey, hey manager! A customer's here! Did you call oh, yes! Did you call me? Huh? Hajime's the customer? Do you have a problem with that? What are you gonna Fuck do? Fuck yes. <laughs> and you said you didn't want to watch it, but I know you wanted to see it all along. If that's what Tsundere Hajime looks like, then you're a really tough girl. I know what that means because of the dating game we played with the apple. Oh yeah, you soon piece of shit. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you, Chop Chop. You were so, you are so devoted to meeting Tsundere that you even bought the Monokuma sticker for 1.5 million dollars! Huh? I called it Soon Deer. You- <laughs> Soon a deer. <laughs> a female deer. You right. pay a drop in <laughs> a drop a piece of shit. <laughs> you paid <laughs> you paid 1.5 million dollars for a sticker. It's nothing. Listen up. It's my family's money. <laughs> in exchange for not watching this movie, Hajime paid 1.5 million dollars for a Monokuma sticker. Come on, since we're talking about it anyway, why don't you show it to Nagito? Stop it! <laughs> it's not like I like you or anything. I'm shy, lol. <laughs> But my resistance was in vain, and Monokuma reached into my pocket and took the sticker. Say it's this one! I'm sorry, I was born stupid. <laughs> you bought this for 1.5 million dollars? Awesome! Oh, but in the end, in the end, you still gotta watch the movie. Who cares about that anymore? Just hurry up and give me an invitation ticket. Here. Fuck! Okay, here you go! It already says so on the invitation ticket, but it's only effective today at this time. By the way, I can only give away one ticket per person. You only have one chance to watch it for free! Fuck! <laughs> I've already stamped today's date into the ticket, so you won't be able to cheat. Don't worry, I only plan to watch it once. To it. Then I'll go prepare the projection reel. Please wait a bit, okay? Hey. Ah. That gives us time to talk! <laughs> Fuck. Yeah, I'm jealous of Ibuki right now. <laughs> <laughs> About that invitation ticket, I strongly recommend you keep that safe. Huh? Why? No reason. Just think of it as a protective charm. But it's gonna be really important later. Empty the truth bullet. This movie's been added. I guess I should just wait until Monokuma finishes his preparations. Out, I guess. Popcorn. It's a food <laughs> shop. Lots of things like popcorn sandwiches, and drinks. For all. <laughs> I don't think this pertains. Food, drink, yes, please. <laughs> <laughs> hey, do you want to talk? Oh, it's food over here. <laughs> popcorn, three, three popcorns. Food, drink. That's what. It, yes, that's my order. Oh yeah, we can eat while we talk to each other. <laughs> <laughs> I can't hear while I'm eating. I'm so hungry. This one looks like a tote bag made of hemp cloth with the decal of Monomi's face on it. 
How did that catch your eye? Small papers tell you it's very useful for a variety of common tasks. As a limited item, only one person can have it. And then die! If the tote bag is gone, that means... One person has it. <laughs> Whoa there! We're interested in buying that tote bag! It's covered in blood now! Well, that's just too bad. It's already sold out. You just say sold. Who'd you sell it to? You're so <laughs> stupid! There's no way I'd fall for that. There's no way I'd say something that'd reveal who the killer is. <laughs> oh, that was the bag over the head. Yeah. Oh, got it. So the killer bought it? Ah! Ah! <laughs> no, the murder victim bought it. <laughs> <laughs> I remember you said there was only one because it's a limited item, right? Ah, um, it's not limited to one. It's more like it's limited to one person. What's the difference? Hey, when you buy one bag, you get another one free. It's a common practice to bait customers with bonus prizes to come back and buy a product that there's no more of. For some reason, hearing you say that pisses me off! That's it. Alright. That's the tweet. <laughs> now, now then, I should forget that I carelessly made a slip of the tongue. Not my favorite saying that people use. What? Like, that's it. That's, that's the, the tweet. tweet. Like. I know that's the tweet. I'm reading the tweet. <laughs> <laughs> no, but it's cool and funny though. Yeah. Nobody. <laughs> Nobody ever. And then something else. Yeah. And then the thing you could have just started with. Yeah. Like you could have stood alone on its own. But you had to say nobody. Hey, do you ever see really funny things on Instagram and then like the person who posted it writes like an extra comment below it like in f for the post and you're like kind of killed the joke kind of made it way less funny i was gonna say no before you ended that statement but then you kept going <laughs> did you ever see a funny thing on instagram no <laughs> you can stop there <laughs> ironically that's what the the idea i was trying to get across <laughs> shit goes on too long uh, oh poo, 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 poo. All right. Um, okay, then this movie poster. I already looked at that. Yeah, let's just start the movie. Make movie film. What's with all this fucking weird lighting shit? I like it. Um, I apologize for keeping you waiting. World famous director Monokuma presents a stunning masterpiece that reduced American audiences to tears. The Wizard of Manomi 2.5D will be screening shortly. From the title alone, I have a bad feeling about this. 2.5D, that sounds so half-assed. It's like they made a 2D game, but with 3D graphics. Now then, please relax and enjoy the film. <laughs> oh boy, we gotta watch the whole fucking movie. Oh. What's the runtime on this? 2.5D. 2.5 days. <laughs> Monokuma was born in a remote village yeah, we full really of are watching the whole thing. because Jesus. the death rates outpaced the birth rates. I sure hope it has an annoying lighting effect that gives me a seizure. <laughs> um, okay. Oh. Whoa. Monokuma was swept up by a tornado created by a helicopter gunship during a routine military exercise. Ugh, I've seen it a hundred times. I think this is the person who does the voice of Monokuma. Really? It's just speaking normally? It's got the same kind of like, sort of weird... Let me listen. Like, back of the throat kind of sound. And was whisked away to Monami's country. I think you're totally right. Yeah. Yeah. Monokuma wanted to return to his homeland so he could go back to pestering the old people for change. Okay. So he began his journey to see the wizard. How, how, how is somebody going to be en end up dying by being hung and then desires. taped to a pole in a music venue? We're going to find out. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> Down in front. <laughs> Shh. And then you like loudly start opening a Snickers bar. <laughs> Shut the fuck up. Sorry, sorry, sorry. <laughs> No, oh, it's Monomi. Monokuma oh. met a Monomi scarecrow who was missing a brain when he recommended that she. <laughs> <laughs> you have to say unalived herself. The oh, okay. The scarecrow hanged herself and died. Got it. Okay. He also met a Monomi lion who was missing her courage. Uh -huh. So he pumped her full of arrows. Got it. Well then. 
<laughs> he also met a Monami Tin Man who was missing a heart. <laughs> So Monokuma sliced her into lumps of iron. <laughs> and then he threw his arms over there! <laughs> <laughs> Keep going. Mm -hmm. After a lot of other stuff happened, Monokuma finally- It was her fucking sister, <laughs> bro! <laughs> she wore a hat and came down on a fucking broom, dog! <laughs> Eventually, one thing led to another, and he started beating the crap out of Monami. That's pretty I have a feeling that the guy who does the voices for this really in enjoys the these end, lines. Yeah. He somehow usurped the kingdom. You can like her. hear his smile a little bit. <laughs> okay. Mm -hmm. With this, the guys are like, oh, just watch. The old people took their pensions and lived the rest of his days in luxury. Were we gonna meet a wizard or something? Yeah. <laughs> this was the this was the movie that. Uh, Nagito said he would pay 1.5 million dollars to not have seen again. Hmm. <laughs> We're watching it right now. I mean, like it sucked, and but he lived happily ever after. The end. Like, would you have? I think I'd hold on to my million and a half <laughs> if I had such a sum. If I had such, sum in my back pocket. <laughs> huh. Man, movies are the best! That drama was so moving that I needed two boxes of tissues, one for each hand. It was a movie movie? So... No, no, no then, let's meet again at the toilet class trial. Bye. Goodbye, bye, bye. Uh, no lie. I'm too disgusted to even let us... Uh, uh, I'm too disgusted to even let out a sigh right you, now. I'm disgusted too. That's all I can say to describe the situation. Really rough to watch and listen to. Oh, thanks. I'm sure I'll be experiencing it with more of my senses soon. Appreciate your feedback. <laughs> <laughs> I'll take it into account next time. Yeah. Uh, feel free to fill out a complaint card and <laughs> place it directly up your ass. How was it? Actually, I don't even have to ask. I totally expected your reaction. That was honestly the worst movie I've ever seen. Is it even okay to call that a movie? No. But thanks to that movie, now you know, right? Yeah. Well, no. Not really. Just like he said, the characters who were killed in the movie match the victims in this case. No, they don't. Nobody was taped to a pole and throat slit. Well, the the Tin Man got sliced up. Maybe that's what they're referring to. It was a different kind of slicing, but it wasn't. I think it was a reference to the lion one, because the lion was was on the tree. Attached to the tree and then arrows, right? Yeah, but there were no arrows in her. Exactly! Her so I don't cut. know why people are like, this is an imitation murder! It's like, I wouldn't have even thought for a second. Maybe it was a combination. Like, well, they'll probably say it. Ibuki's death by hanging matched the Scarecrow's death in the movie. Not just that, but Hyoko's spent a body oh. matches the lion's death, too. There you go. It would have been a complete imitation if the killer killed three people, but it seems that wasn't possible. Perhaps the killer is upset about that right now, or... If the killer's main goal was just an imitation murder, they should be upset about it, but... I'm not sure if that's even true. So... Also, why? Everybody saw the movie, and then somebody was like, I'm gonna kill some people in the same way. Yeah. Just one of these fucking kids. Okay. It's, it's what the damned rock and roll does. <laughs> it's what rock and roll, Pokemon, and Harry Potter do to these kids! Yep. They bring the devil into them! Hello! Hello! Hello. It's me, Monokuma! Yay! Awesome! The class trial's gonna start, you oh, know? Oh, shit. So, oh, okay. Sure I guess we're doing it. To Monokuma Rock ASAP! But you know what? I'm glad. But we're not done. What? I'm ready. I'm but ready to I, do the trial. I don't feel like we have enough evidence at all. Well, I, I mean, the game. It, yeah, this game's on rails, man. Yeah. It wouldn't do anything. It's already time. So this again. I need to go to that place again. But that was not the time to be a coward. The reason Ibuki and Hyoko became victims in order to find the truth, the only thing I can do is go. Are you talking to yourself? <laughs> um bye. <laughs> where was it? Was it on the first island or Oh. Uh no. Uh sorry. <laughs> Monica <Monica's right. laughs> God damn, stop burping. What did you eat? I didn't eat anything, I drank... Peach Rings flavored G-Fuel. That's the Sonic the Hedgehog flavor. 
Mm. It's the official drink of esports. What does that mean? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Made with bits of real hedgehog. <laughs> wow, there's lighter attendance this time. Oh yeah, it's not a whole lot of people left, eh? I Wait, there's still like ten people left. Yeah, though. there's there's a couple people missing here. Uh, whoops. Is anybody here? Do you guys want to go to the class truck? Hey, Jack, hold it right there. Money what? Don't something. get in my way. You're just a dumb little sister who's short a few brain cells. Hey. What the fuck, dude? My brain works just fine. Hey. I have a gamer brain. <laughs> Monokuma, what did you do with Nikomaru? I see. So you've come to avenge him. What? Avenge? That sounds like he died. <laughs> he died. Sounds like you say, oops. Anyways, Anyways since Nico Maru is unfortunately unavailable today, let's what, just say he... he's absent. Uh, did he fucking kill Nekomaru off screen? Well, he was injured. He, he shot was him injured. With a, he shot him with a rocket. I remember that. Yeah. Now then, I gotta go first. But he was definitely alive. I don't know. Maybe Nekomaru did it. Maybe he turned Nekomaru into Cyborg, and then Nekomaru did it as a Cyborg under Monokuma's control. You know what? It's not the weirdest thing it really that would isn't. have happened in this game today. I like that. I like this. <laughs> <laughs> I miss us. <laughs> it's like, this is a video game that I'm playing right now. <laughs> <laughs> you know? I wish this was my phone background <laughs> so I could look at it 800 times a day. <laughs> Escape. Hey, Hi. Hey. Did you hear what he said? Whoops. Huh? Don't worry about it. There's no way Nekomaru's dead. He's just trying to piss us off. I'll it's fucking not. kill him! Of course he's not. Of course he's not dead. There's no way. Not in a million years. Well. More importantly, it's best if we worry about ourselves for now. <laughs> if something happens here, every one of us except Nekomaru will die. <laughs> Why are you so excited about that? How about it? Fucking because! Yeah, because I suck. Who knows? Maybe I'm just looking forward to seeing poetic justice prevail! What do you want her to say, fiend? <laughs> You'll find out soon enough. See? Then let's go. I'm gonna do it! Alright, let's hurry up and get this over with. Yeah, you're right. I wonder if she ever injures that hand because she's constantly punching it. <laughs> Ow! <laughs> it's getting bruised. Ow! Fuck! <laughs> Roar. <laughs> Roar. Well, okay. Yeah, well. <laughs> I just forget it's not finished. We stepped onto the escalator and descended toward the gaping maw of Monokuma Rock. Ah, my maw! <laughs> That's when I s it's gaping! That's when I suddenly noticed it. I noticed our lined up silhouettes getting smaller and smaller, but I can't turn back now! I hate this fucking, like, waxing poetic that he does yeah, yeah. every time before his- The blood, the big, the hottest despair, the hottest hope, never again, L lowering down into the depths of hell. The most hopeful heat. <laughs> if I just, if I turn back, I won't be able to press forward. Oh, so profound. You're so right, Hajime. And when everyone was inside Monokuma Rock, it ate us. We all died. Crunch and mo oh, oh. Uh. Is that normal? Did that happen every time? Yeah, it okay, did. Okay, I forgot. Oh yeah, elevator's beginning to look uh, a little bit lighter. The elevator began its deep descent as usual. Is yeah, I guess Nekomaru is the only one that's missing. <laughs> you know what I think about all the time? What's that? <laughs> you know the good game where you did that line. <laughs> Here, take some prosciutto. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Was that a written line, or did we just- add I, That was the line, but the way you said it was- Oh yeah, improvised. completely incorrect. Yeah. yeah. But nobody said a word. As we stood there trying to figure out what to say to each other, the elevator descended deeper and deeper. Is anybody gonna- Somebody wanted to say a to fucking, fucking joke, joke or something? Or something? <laughs> <laughs> and when it descended as far as it could go, it finally stopped. The elevator doors open slowly, almost tantalizingly so. Like, How does the moon cut his hair? Eclipse it! <laughs> Alright. I'm sorry. <laughs> it's like it gets real quiet in the elevator for the next, like, 30 seconds. Um. How... 
how does how does the moon when the moon streams and then he wants to uh post <laughs> small chunks of it on YouTube how does he do it how he clips it <laughs> Whoa. Don't tell me you made that one up. Did you just pour no sonic juice all over yourself? No. All right. This is a video. It's an audio show. No, I. Pretty I, sure people heard it. I ended up actually just like suddenly becoming super ripped, and now I'm really ripped and strong, and like my titties are huge, mm -hmm. and I just have a washboard. I have like a ten pack. That's what happened. Yeah, no, I can see that. Look at it. And you also spilled Sonic juice on. Well, that's neither here nor there, man. Those cut up titties of yours. <laughs> Big honking honkaroos. I know, they're fucking awesome, right? <laughs> Light poured through from the other side. Light out through the other side. We are losing our minds. Eroding the boundaries of the darkness. What other useless shit am I going to say? <laughs> and I walked into that place. <laughs> One way to find out. <laughs> my, my, it feels pretty toothless with all these empty seats. Well, two people got killed at the same time, and Nicomaru's not here either. She reaches up and grabs a mushroom. <laughs> <laughs> I have a, uh, one up! <laughs> Is Nicomaru really not participate? If he's alive, you should invite him, you fuck. No, no. Why bother? Oh, the old Republic is calling me. What, from Star Wars? <laughs> Take a picture of this. Wow. It's the older public. Yeah, that is amazing. <laughs> cool. Okay. Big little screenshot. Please continue. What? Well now. Now then, let's begin. Yeah. It's the beginning of the long way to class, class trial. Fuck. Please enjoy it to your heart's content. All right. I love it. Trial her. three, baby. And so the curtain to the third class trial was about to open. Here we go. It, the curtain was like the falling of the ancient Rome. Blow! <laughs> <laughs> Ibuki Miyota, the ultimate dead girl. She was really loud, but she was the mood maker of our group. Now she's not making any sound. When I was with her, all my pain and suffering just seemed to melt away. What the fuck really? are you talking about? I never heard you mention anything like that. Hyoko Sayonji, the ultimate traditional dancer. She was the nicest person I ever <laughs> knew. <laughs> she definitely never called anyone a toilet clogging bitch. <laughs> Just from looking at her adorable face, you'd know she was dead. <laughs> you'd never know she was actually selfish and foul-mouthed, but she was trying to change herself, I'm convincing myself of, <laughs> just to say something nice, and she was desperately trying to come to terms with Mahiru's death. The person who killed those two is among us, or not. <laughs> People, I definitely can't believe it. Remember Teru Teru? God, that was so long ago. He was great. But whether I believe it or not, it's irrelevant. Man, people from this screen really got the raw deal. <laughs> Unless I figure out the truth, I won't be able to escape from this <laughs> hell. Kiyoko's like, Ooh, I'm dead. <laughs> <laughs> I look like I'm from Rick and Morty. <laughs> That's why I must find out, no matter the cost. For our sake! For a friend's sake! I love sake! <laughs> <laughs> and so the curtain to the third class trial was about to open. We know. <laughs> it's been about to open for like 30 minutes now. Yeah. Uh, this life-threatening trial billowing with hope and despair it's has like waiting begun. for a Guns N' Roses concert to start. Could be like a minute, could be six hours. <laughs> it's 13 opening acts. <laughs> I'm done. Oh, fuck. Okay, hold on. What happened? Now prepare. then, let's begin with a simple oh. explanation of the class trial. Oh my god, it feels like we were just here. Yeah, I know. Well, because we've been going a little bit longer, so now we're cruising. Okay, this doesn't need to be plugged in anymore. Um, alright, so, let me just set up this fucking garbage. <laughs> Aaron. What? J just, here, you want to give me the control? I'll click yeah, yeah, through. yeah, go ahead, go ahead. Yeah, 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 yeah. During the class trial, you will present your arguments for who the killer is and vote for who done it. If How could we possibly please, not know this information at this point? Will receive punish, I'll punish Just so you know how this works. Oh well, who cares about this boring explanation? Let's get on with it 
already. Thank you, Monica. I don't mind starting the trial, but I don't really have a grasp of how the case played out. <laughs> so it'll be fine. You know, because I was asleep the whole time. Hilarious. <laughs> Even if you do grasp it, you're just going to confuse the heck out of us, aren't you? But Nagito's not alone. I don't really get it either. I don't think any of us do, dude. No, no. You're fine. Your head's empty anyway. Pod, palm swempty. Mom spaghetti. <laughs> <laughs> wrong with that <laughs> wow <laughs> the emptier your head the more dreams you can stuff inside it you know a Akane, i'm gonna need you to do like one more button yeah like one this is a this is a place of law <laughs> anyway we shouldn't this proceed with the trial if those two can't participate There's in a lot the of argument. respect in these walls <laughs> since he's the first witness why don't we ask <laughs> put some respect on my name poopy mcbutt farts poopy mcbutt farts <laughs> 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 then, let's start with when we split into the hospital Oops, team Jackson. and the hotel team because of the despair disease. Okay. The hospital team consisted of Nagito, Ibuki, and Akane, who were infected, and Mikan, Fuyuhiko, and me. The other five yep. in the motel team were myself, Gundam, Kazuichi, Chiaki, and Hyoko. Myself, Gundam, the like, killer. I know all these people, but when I see their names listed out, I'm like, I can't process that. Yeah. <laughs> Kazuyuchi Kiyaki and Hyoko. And in the night at the hospital was prohibited, so Hajime and I had to sleep at our cottages. Oh, okay. What are you fucking whispering to a baby right now? <laughs> so Hajime just went to sleep at our cottages. I woke up at my cottage on the day the incident happened. And I was like, ah, oh, what a lovely day! I'm gonna have eggs! And told me that Nagito had recovered from his symptoms. Maybe I'll have the eggs this morning, tossed eggs, and more scrambled eggs. <laughs> Some delicious eggs. <laughs> Thank you, eggs! Mikan came to wake me up and told me that Nagito had recovered from his symptoms, and that's all that happened. We immediately headed over to the hospital, and after we confirmed his recovery, I made Mikan rest in the on-call room, since she hadn't slept all night, while I waited in the hospital lobby. We cuddled at least like seven times. It was, yeah, that was strange. Blinking before our scheduled time. When I pressed the button to turn on the monitor, what appeared on screen was. It was like awesome. It was like fucking Game of Thrones season four at its peak. Climbing a step ladder. Amazing! That's such a hard pounding story. Shut the, shut Somebody and then what did you stuff do, a Hajime? potato into his mouth? Bro, I was having potatoes in my mouth. God damn it! <laughs> I tried to stop them, of course. <laughs> I, I tried to stop them, of course, but I rushed out of the hospital and ran to where the video was being recorded, the music venue. But it was too <laughs> late. <laughs> oh, thank God. <laughs> but it was too late. By the time I arrived. The person wearing the hemp bag on their head was already hanging from the ceiling. I had one thought. I thought Free I sandals for me. Right away, <laughs> so I headed to the motel. I grabbed him and I'm wearing them to this day. Why the motel? Because more free sandals there. <laughs> and unlike the hospital, there were more able-bodied people there. At least, that's what I thought. But the only person who came with me was Chiaki. And she's not able-bodied at all. But I remember feeling a little Aww. relieved because not long after... We, we met up with Mika. We did have such stuff. nice time together. That's like her face. <laughs> I remember the Christmas from last year. <gasps> he remembered <laughs> after we found the dead body. <laughs> we were also looking for Ibuki since she disappeared from our site. I'm still not sure where she is. Did they just like tell him? Like you're a different character now. You don't have to. Yeah. You don't have to be like I'm right fucking. You know, I remember this. Well, he's definitely undergone like. A personality shift since Peko Peko died. Oh, yeah. He's become and a lot then, more gentle. I noticed Ibuki was gone, so I, I sprinted out of the hospital. Coincidentally, I ran to Fuyuhiko, so I bred with him in various ways to see if he could help me out. Okay. Then I broke down and cried for six and a half hours. <laughs> yeah. I pled with him in furious ways. I was like, please help. And then I was like, you're gonna fucking help me. And then, oh, I'm sorry. I didn't mean to say, but did you need to help me? Furious ways? Don't say it like that and confuse people. <laughs> He's blushing. After I heard from those two that Ibuki disappeared, I had a feeling she was the person wearing the hemp bag. So I immediately led them to the music venue. But okay. the door wouldn't open. Since we had no other option, the four of us broke down the door. This is probably the fourth or fifth time we're revisiting <laughs> when that this. Happened, 
We didn't just find Ibuki's body. We also found Hiyoko's. What? Hiyoko's just... body is the killer. The <laughs> yeah. to a pillar. Pillar rhymes with killer. Discovery announcement. Not once, but twice in a row. And so we decided to lower the hanged body, didn't we? No, you're wrong. <laughs> we, the we raised it to the skies. <laughs> Praise God. <laughs> <laughs> Praise him. <laughs> so that's how the case played out. Thank you. I understood it very easily. Well, it's clear what the problem with this case is. It and sucks. Left the music venue. Who? Wait. How do I know anything Hajime just said is true? <gasps> oh. Sorry. I'm only being impartial right now. And the story I just heard is clearly suspicious. Oh, is it? I'm the narrator, Hajime, fuckface. The character the camera was following me the whole time. Video <laughs> and the first one to discover yeah. You have Game Grumps episodes to prove it. Yeah. <laughs> Exhibit A! <laughs> These assholes! <laughs> <laughs> what? You lying as much as you want right now. Rock. Lie? Why would I lie? Why I lie? Obviously. So you could make us ignore what might be an inconvenient truth for you. Oh, okay. Let's not talk about conspiracy theories here. Do you doubt here. me? <laughs> Do you? Well, uh, Nikito, we were best friends! <laughs> not lying. I would like you to prove it. Put your plums in my mouth. Try to prove it to me. <laughs> prove you're not the killer. It's the only way you can prove to me. I'm gonna you're knock not him around for a little bit with my tongue, <laughs> and then I'll see. I'll taste your innocence. <laughs> oh, God. La, 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 like this. La, 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 la. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> it's just as Kazuichi said. Nagito is the kind of guy who will just confuse us and make matters worse. What a cuck! <laughs> Damn it, I shouldn't have explained it to Nagito. I'm in trouble now thanks to that. Fuck! Wow, do, God do, damn. Do. Everyone else is like, we don't care. Me, me, we believe me, you. You're just being an asshole. Alright. Alright. Hajime's testimony is clearly suspicious. Is that really it? The fact that Ibuki hung herself. That would also be a lie. Hajime's a baller, huh? I don't think I can deny that possibility. <laughs> After all, Hajime's the only witness. Oh. The wielder of cursed eyes. Why would Hajime lie? Why I lie? Well, obviously, because he's the killer. <laughs> Did Hajime kill both of them? The fact that the bodies were imitating the movie. Oh, nicely done. No, yeah. We were like, blah, 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 blah. I didn't see the movie. And he oh. was there to, to Oh, know. yeah. I mean, there's no way I'd be able to imitate that movie. Of course you're not. I already knew that. Fuck you! Fuck you! Just like leaps over the table. You fucking- <laughs> Ah, stop! <laughs> you fucking asshole! Huh? Oh my god, Hajime! <laughs> Before the incident, Hajime had never watched that movie. His invitation ticket is proof of that. <laughs> the invitation ticket?! <laughs> Each person only received one ticket, and they're marked with a stamp that shows the date and time. Isn't that right, Monokuma? No. Yes. No mistakes there. <laughs> Which means there's no way Hajime, who never saw the movie, could commit <laughs> murder. Hajime's like, imitated. I hate you. Yeah. <laughs> or did anyone tell him what happens in the movie? Of course, no one did, right? I did. <laughs> Hold on a sec. You're the one who brought this up in the first place! Nagito, what are you doing? <laughs> Nagito? <laughs> yeah. Well, what are you doing? I feel like I could ask that once an episode. <laughs> yeah. I thought we should solidify I'm eating foundation. sour worms. It also provides a good warm-up. What warm-up? This isn't a game, you know. Haha, <laughs> that's where you're wrong, looks directly at camera. <laughs> Don't get mad. I just think warming up is really important. Especially since this isn't a game. It's so a game! <laughs> well, I knew it would turn out like this anyway. <laughs> you're just all thrown off. You're like, you know what, Nagito? If we if we end up having sex, I mean success! And he's like, ooh, paging Dr. Freud, you know? <laughs> Shut up! I didn't say that! <laughs> Shut, Shut it! Now then, since we know Hajime's testimony is reliable, let us move on to the arguments. 
Remember Teru Teru? <laughs> Vaguely. Sabuki definitely climbed the step ladder all by herself, right? I don't know if it's Ibuki. Yeah, I'm positive. No, you're not. Then that seals it. Ibuki committed suicide. Shut up. Yeah, punch hand. <laughs> Woo! Now you can touch my boobs. Yoko. <laughs> Hmm. A murder coincidentally occurring in the same place. Boy, she hates G's at the end of her words. Possible, huh? Occurring. <laughs> like I said before, it's pretty clear what the problem with this case is. The killer murdered Hiyoko while I Hajime wasn't killed. Was gone. <laughs> so all we gotta do is establish who could have possibly done that. Then let's ask Hajime. How long would you say you were away from the music venue? I you. need to take a smoke break. Fucking dick. <laughs> I couldn't have been gone for more than 10 minutes. So they killed Hyoko and taped her up within 10 minutes? There's no way that's possible. That's why the killer stalled for time by making the music venue a closed room. Oh. Mm -hmm. What do you mean a closed room? I mean a room that's closed. Yes, a room. I'm glad you asked, Kade. <laughs> <laughs> it's a room with a door that's been sealed so you cannot enter. What? What does cannot enter mean? The killer the <laughs> Another great from question. <laughs> to try and keep us from entering right away. However, that door is the only entrance to the music venue, right? If they blocked the door from the inside, the killer would not have been able to leave either. Hmm. Yeah, you're absolutely right. Oh, I didn't think about that. Which means, when we broke down the venue door, the killer was still inside. What the fuck kind of venue only has a front door and not like a load-in door? I don't know. <laughs> and a front door that never locks. Yeah. If that's the case, the only suspicious people are those who don't have an alibi for that time. And that's you two! Sonia and Kazuichi! Uh, 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 I was with my four dark Davis. <laughs> we were... Um... <laughs> exploring? Yeah. What the hell? Why's it gotta be us? The others all have alibis. Chiaki, Mikon, Hajime, and I all broke down the venue door together. Gundam met up with Hajime at the motel right before that. Unspoken for before that, but still. Yeah. And if Akane and Nagito were laid up in the hospital, the only person that leaves is one of you. There's another person who doesn't have an alibi. <laughs> Me. <No. laughs> Uh-oh. <laughs> Me too. What? Hey, why are you talking like, huh? <laughs> <laughs> what? What's happening? You're kidding, right? You're not up to something weird, are you? Uh, what's weird about this scenario? Stop making bad jokes. <laughs> what bad jokes? Anyway, if the killer was hiding inside the venue, we should obviously doubt the people who don't have alibis. Okay. What a wicked way of backing us into a wall! Is this his professional skill? <laughs> boop, boop, so boop, 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 boop. The killer was inside the music venue. Fuyuhiko obviously thinks so, but I don't think so. Yeah. That's the first assumption of an eight assumption trial. Mm hmm. Ah. Manager. The killer was still inside the music venue. No! You're wrong! My semi transparent glob! Boom. Oh. Oh, motherfucker! It seems they were trying. How did they lock the door? That door should not have- The lock was on the- mm -hmm. Hurry up! Uh-huh. as if by doing that, the kid waited until we get- And suddenly- Why did it, it was there? I hate this I fucking game. I've seen this in serial crime <laughs> dramas. Why, I, just, I saw- you saw the whole thing go into the thing before it moved. Use the concentration. The killer Slow was down. still inside oh, the music too. venue. Fucking epic, dude. I know you're epic, Locking Aaron. The door no one's- the inside. Fuck! God damn it! Fuck! Fucking! I told you I'm epic. Yeah, I know. I know. I know. Just believe me. Just a little too epic. To just do the fucking thing. Well, they made it so you have to like shoot it on an, 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 an non-specific amount of times. Push the slowdown button. Still inside the music venue. By locking the door from the inside. So easy. No, that's wrong. Hi. There's also a possibility Hold on a second. that the door was locked from the outside. From the outside? How? With know. a drumstick on the inside! There's a semi-transparent glob stuck to the venue door. Maybe that's what they used. Oxy-carrying semi brand semi-transparent glob? Like rubber, maybe? From Dow Chemicals? 
That was rubber at all. The semi-transparent glob was... Blue? It wasn't rubber. Gummy? No, it tasted gross, so I guess it was blue. I see! That semi-transparent glob must have been glue. Glue? Okay. <laughs> yeah, glue! <laughs> yeah, I think so too. I ate it. <laughs> and like, I've had gummy. Yeah. <laughs> I've had what the other, the other shit was gum. gum. It had a firm gel like. I, here, it's in my mouth now. <laughs> and I could smell workshop chemicals the moment I put it in my mouth. Based on all that, I'm certain it was glue. Excuse me, I have to throw up. <laughs> yes, I didn't know glue was edible. I believe it's it is not, not something one typically eats. That glue was only applied to the areas where both doors touched. Okay. By pouring it in the gaps of Wouldn't the closed that be the door, entire part? it must have sealed the venue door <laughs> from the outside. And thanks to that, a glob of glue was left where the door was stuck. Yep, it fits perfectly. I think maybe I should eat some more evidence, though, to be sure. <laughs> Does anyone have the rope? <laughs> Firm chewiness. If you just stick them together with glue, you'd be able to break down the door easily, you know? That doesn't okay. really matter. The killer only did that to make us think the door was locked from the inside. What'd you say? What? First of all, didn't that drumstick we found seem really obvious? Almost unnaturally so? Oh, so they like broke the drumstick? Yeah, and, and just, just like left it, it there, the planet. Yeah. It was so obvious that it makes more sense to think the killer placed it as a diversion. Or played a fucking disgusting drum solo and broke it because they were playing with too much passion. Oh no! I better eat part of the drumstick to make sure. <laughs> the killer set on purpose? It tastes gross. Then I. I totally fell for that fucking trap. Language. I'm gonna fucking kill that trap! <laughs> Apologize to Miss Sonia and me. However, you're not allowed to slice open your stomach this time. Um, I'm sorry. Who are you talking to? Tomorrow, both sides are to blame. That's why it's better to just have no sides at all. Take it from me. I'm mostly circular. <laughs> so, during the ten minutes Hajime left the venue, the killer murdered Hiyoko and created a closed space. And they also taped her up after killing her, right? No. Killing. Quick killing her. <laughs> Someone's dead. Oh, What unimaginable speed for a slowpoke like me. I could never kill someone that fast. Oh, you, not me! Well, next time on Game Grumps, we'll find out more. Bye! Oh, God, okay! Oof. This is getting interesting. Yo. Alright, kisses and hugs, I love you. Rampa is a good game. Nice.